In this tutorial, we will be learning about configuring Oracle Spatial Studio and connecting with Oracle Database, importing spatial data in Spatial Studio. To do so, download the Spatial Studio from Oracle official website. Oracle Spatial Studio is designed to assist users in working with spatial data, which involves data related to geographic locations and features. It provides tools and capabilities for visualizing and analyzing spatial information stored in the Oracle database. Oracle Spatial Studio is accessed through a web browser, offering a user-friendly interface that allows users to interact with spatial data without requiring complex software installations on individual machines. Once Oracle Download Manager is downloaded, begin the downloading associated files with Spatial Studio. Once download is completed, open the destination folder and extract the zip file containing Spatial Studio. Once the download is completed, extract the Spatial Studio from the zip file. From the folder containing Spatial Studio, navigate to the File Start Windows Batch file and double-click on it to run the file. Wait till the process get completed. When the Oracle Spatial Visualization Server started, open a web browser and write a URL with localhost with port 4040 slash Spatial Studio and hit enter. Choose the metadata connection type as Oracle Database and click Next. Please check on my previous video on installing Oracle Database if you don't. And specify the metadata schema details for the database connection with appropriate username, password, and port and click OK. This process will connect with database and will create the repository for the Spatial Studio instance. Once Oracle Studio opened in the web browser console, navigate to Create Connection tab and double-click on it. It will open the database connection window to connect with Oracle Database. Since we have already configured the database instances, I cancel this process. Navigate to the Project tab from the left side console. Click Create Project. It will create a untitled project instance. For instance, I drag and drop the dataset in the QGIS software for the visualization. Click on Add Dataset tab. It returns the empty result as there is no dataset in Spatial Studio repository of Oracle Database. Select the database table view as Spatial Studio and select the local file to be upload. In this case, I select the file with .shp extension and click OK. This results in an error missing files from shapefiles. Therefore, I also have to upload .shx and .dbf file along with .shp file.
We successfully processed the dataset. Now select the database connection as Spatial Studio and define the table name and dataset name and submit. We have successfully inserted the spatial data in Oracle Database and imported it in Spatial Studio. Return to the untitled project and click Add Dataset. And click the imported dataset from Oracle Database. Drag and drop the dataset into Map Console. Oops, there is unreferenced coordinate reference system in our dataset. In order to resolve the problem, export the dataset with a reference coordinate system. In our case, it is WGS84. Now we have successfully imported the data set with correct coordinate reference system in our database. Besides, it is time to play with visualization techniques in Spatial Studio. Let's do it.
open the QGIS project, and refresh the Oracle database connection. Now we can successfully locate the dataset in database. Drag and drop the dataset into the console. We have successfully imported the spatial data from Oracle database into QGIS project. In summary, we have successfully downloaded, configured the Spatial Studio, and imported the spatial data. We have exercised visualization technique in Spatial Studio and imported data from database into QGIS project.